What in a peanut butter and jelly is going on right now, B? First and foremost, shout out to Sue Surface. Looking like he's home. He's home. He tweeted out, he's family with the evil emoji. It looks like Surface home. I can only assume he's talking about chess. But it's just like, I don't understand what's going on. Forget all that. Put that on pause. Shout out to me. Shout out to me. I just found out I'm getting ready to be a father. Like, for real. No jokes. Like, nigga. I went from breaking my arm, my shoulder, all kinds of shit. Okay, having metal pulls put in my chest. All kinds of wild shit. To, 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 to surviving this. To, to two weeks later, I find out I'm getting ready to be a father. And it's going to be twins. I'm about to have twins. Like... Nigga, what the fuck I'm going to do with twins? Oh, man. Shout out to you, niggas, man. This is beautiful right here. I love this shit. I'm going to calm my hot ass down, know what I'm saying? Because I'm having twins now. So shout out to me. Like, fuck <laughs> fuck all that. Shout out to me. Now, let's get right back to it, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Sue Surf. I'm glad he's home. Um, Surf, my nigga, I'm going to be real with you. Be, unless you have, like, a parking ticket or some shit like that, I am not trying to hear no free Sue Surf no more. Come on, my nigga. You too old for this shit. I said it when you wasn't here. I'm going to say it when you're here. We don't want to say free suit surf no more. We really fucking don't. It's about time you either get your ass out these streets or you keep your ass in these streets. One or the other. But it's not fair to your fans when you decide to stay in the streets and, and we, we got all these shits coming up. You got albums getting ready to come out. You, you got fucking summer impact coming up and we, we worried about you and, and when you're getting out and all kinds of shit like that. That shit ain't even what's up. You know what I'm saying? But I'm glad you fucking made it home. If you home, I'm going to say if. Because anybody could be tweeting he's family with a devil emoji. Anybody really could do that. It's not like we know for a fact that Surf. We go into the fact that someone tweeted from his Twitter. But I can see Surf actually saying that. Um, what do we do right now? That's the question. So, does Surf take his spot back? And his gun, and his original, like how it was, gun titles versus... Uh, 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 hollow and loaded lux, and then chest just sits on the sideline. See, I look at it like this to be real true. Obviously, URL didn't know what the hell was really gonna go on. They said, fuck it, he probably gonna step in there. we gonna get chest where we know it's safe, you know what I'm saying? But now that he's out, it's like, did they tell chess, okay, you're gonna battle as long as surf stays in there, or did they just say, okay, we brushing surf out all the way automatically, chest, you taking the spot. It doesn't even matter if this nigga's out. You know what I'm saying? That's Chess's spot. What's going on right now? Who would you niggas rather see? A lot of hype is around Chess right now. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like... I know, all I know is this right here. You do realize that if Loaded Lux and Hollow loses, it's going to be because of this bullshit right here, right? They're going to be like, yo, we didn't even know who the hell we was even writing for. One minute, it's... It, it's you know what I'm saying? It's Surf and it's Rock. The next minute, it's Chess and Rock. We turn around and it's Surf and Rock again. Like, it's this weekend, my niggas. The event is this weekend. So I don't think that Surf is going to take his spot back, I, uh, honestly. I think it's going to stay chess. That might make, the, not might make the most sense. I mean, Surf might have memorized what he was going to write, but I think it's so much hype around chess. It's, it's just going to look crazy. And then for Hollow and Lux, y'all niggas is really fucking the battle up for these niggas because they're not going to know what the fuck they're doing. You know what I'm saying? That's, what are they going to do? Get somebody else and y'all going to make it a three-man battle? No. So it's just like, I don't know what's going on, but Surf is definitely a home. It looks like I'm happy. You know what I'm saying? Keep your ass out of prison. Um, I don't know. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? That's whack. Because Surf, like Surf, you just you definitely just missed a lot of bread on this battle. I know you ain't get that the other half of your part of, of, of your deposit and shit you're not, if you're not battling. You know what I'm saying? And shit, you got all this. And another thing, it's kind of fucked up, Surf, because you, you helped Chess. You know what I'm saying? Because you gave Chess probably the biggest battle of his life. But you, well, as far as opponents go, let's not forget he was on BT. You know what I'm saying? But you hurt Chess at the same time. Because if Chess fucks up because of all this pressure, it's going to be your fault. And it's going to look like Chess really can't handle the pressure. You know what I'm saying? Really? So it's just like, it's a gift and it's a fucking curse. Like, you got to keep your ass out them streets, my nigga. I can't tell you to the streets, but I can tell you, you got to be careful, man. You got to think more about how you doing shit, man. You just got to think more about how you doing shit. It's this... You a fucking role model for us. You got to understand. We niggas like to see you. We like to... I like to hear you talk shit. I don't think you know what you're talking about half the time. You always using basketball and sports analogies. But, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, you talk that shit. You believe in what you say. That's why I used to love interviewing you and shit. It's just like, don't nobody want to see nothing happen to you. You know what I'm saying? And and when you keep going to jail, my nigga, like, you don't want to get slapped with that extended term. You know what I'm saying? You don't want that. 
So it's just like, what the fuck? We keep getting nervous every time it's a free serve. We don't know what the fuck going on. You already did a bid, a little mini bid in front of us. Like, we don't want to see you do five, six years and just throw your whole fucking career away, my nigga. You know how many niggas would love to be in your fucking position right now, my nigga? Like, real rap. How many niggas would want to be known as, as one of the niggas in battle rap, which has grown to where it's at? You're one of the niggas in battle rap. You make fire music, one of the D, uh, uh, uh. I don't even want to say up and coming artists because you've been making art music for a little while now. But it's just like you fuck with the artists. Like niggas would love to be in your fucking position. They really would. I see you got a fucking uh, a, a new chain that's just insane. So it's just like don't fuck that up over nothing. Don't fuck that up over nothing. You know what I'm saying? That ain't what's up. Hey, from the fuck up. Uh, 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 I'm about to hit, man. I ain't going to ramp y'all niggas. But shout out to me. Shout out to me. I'm twins. Oh my god, my nigga, I found that shit out. I got so happy. I seen the sonogram. I found that shit. I got so happy. I passed the fuck out. Like, yo, I, I passed out. I passed out. Twins. I passed out. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, man. But I'll tell you one thing. You got a lot of fucking blogs. Come on, can I need that YouTube money? <laughs> nah, you stop playing, man. They from the fuck up them out. One.